hello guys welcome to my channel so today i'm going to continue the series on hacker rank so i'm just two points away on my second star and these are the videos on the series with the title hacker rank you can have a look if you want to see specific problems and i will be posting more videos as i go on in this series so if you are new to this channel if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do it's not asking for any kind of money it's just free but it will keep me motivated in my journey so that i can post more videos okay so without any wasting uh, of time let's start with java loops 2 so the first part has been covered already in this one and we will start with the second part here okay so it seems like a pros uh, series here and there is a pattern that we have to use uh, this one as constant being appending to each series and the series this one is incrementing with the power of 2 right and there are uh, four variables q as in queries a b and n so a is here on the left side b is on the multiplication side and n is okay so n is uh, till uh, till how many um, elements of the series we have to print so that's n so here you see first line contains uh, query q and then the subsequent lines are a b and n okay sounds good to me and then there is this further explanation which i just got so i don't need to read this also the difficulty level e is easy don't get confused by this line it looks uh, complex but it's easy enough so they have already given us this code where we have already uh, the variables now we just have to do the computation so what we need to do is we need to first have a loop why loop because we have to create a series and the power of 2 has to be in a series right so that's why loop so we'll create a variable also which will have the sum and as i said this part a plus 2 to the power 0 into b is constant throughout the series also 2 to the power 0 is nothing but 1 and 1 into b is nothing but b so it's actually a plus b so the first sum will be a plus b which we will save and print but we will not print in the next line but in the same line so sum plus and then we need space as you can see here right so we need a loop so it will start from 1 now because we have already covered the 0th instance right so we will start with to the power 1 so here we will do int i equals to 0 i less than n and being the number of elements in the series i plus plus and then we will do sum plus equals to because we need to have this sum throughout the series and then we will do uh, math dot pow as in power and we will do two comma like first we will write the number on which we have to have a power and then we will uh, provide the number which is the power so here it will be i but we don't need i equals to zero but i equals to one so that's it now we just need to print Sys uh, system dot out dot print so, sorry in a bad habit of using ln and then we will do again some plus space right and then at the end we will have a new line why because we don't have only one query right we can have as many as it says so that's why uh, when we when we uh, find any new uh, query we have to provide that input output actually in the next line not in the same line so that's why ln so if you run the code 
it says compilation error here okay again compilation error uh, why because i is already defined so let's do j so something is wrong uh, the output doesn't match why okay we forgot to multiply actually right uh, we did the power and we forgot to multiply it with with b so let's do that see it's working fine so that's it for this video let's try to submit this and get my second star voila uh, yeah second star yeah okay so um yeah it's a progress right so um so yeah that's it for this video if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet hit that subscribe button and we'll kick on this series with the next video Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.